Hi, this is Brandy at The Graphing Geek. It's been a couple weeks since my last video because I really haven't been getting a lot of stuff in recently. But luckily, uh, school's ending. I'm a substitute teacher. So I will have a lot more time to mail out. I have uh, four right here I'm getting ready to mail out tomorrow. So I'll be adding more and more outgoing stuff my collection but I wanted to show you what I have gotten in and I uh, got a couple of gifts and also what I think well to me is a pretty big purchase so I'm going to jump right in first up signing three for three for me is Mark Spitz so this is a really cool addition to my Olympic collection so he signed Hall of Fame trading card, a photo, and Olympic rings. So I was excited to get that back. That took about a month. I was really surprised, so I was really, really happy to get that back. Next up is a Disney success. I had honestly forgotten I had mailed this one out. It's been out for a while, um, at least six to eight months, maybe longer. But I got William Phipps, who was Prince and Cinderella. If I am not mistaken, he is the last surviving member of the movie. So I'm happy to have him back. I haven't had a Disney addition to my collection in so long. And I need to send some more out. So I was really excited to get that back when I got it. Because, like I said, I forgot that I sent it. Last up for my TTMs is a twofer. I got Harry Dean Stanton. He has a document documentary on Netflix. If you have Netflix, I cannot recommend it enough. It is a great uh, documentary about his movie career and his military career. Um, all of his celebrity friends and women that he was involved with, movies that he made and movies that he refused and he also sang a lot in the move in the documentary, and but I loved it. Um, got this one, and I got this one from Alien. So this is my first Alien success. I'm going to be sending out a lot more. It's one of my favorite movies. Next up, um, to start with the gifts, this is a Just Because from TTM Troy. He was at the Hollywood show, and he was working with Adam Wiley, who you might recognize from Picket Fences when he was a kid. He was on Gilmore Girls, and he did quite a few other things when he was younger. I, I'm not really sure what he's doing so much now as an adult, but I am a huge, huge, huge Gilmore Girls fan, and he was on Gilmore so he signed it to me the best honorary children grad so I was really excited to get that it made my day thank you so much Troy I know I've already told you before but I love it thank you and next up is another gift I got this one today it was an early Mother's Day present from my husband and my son they got me a signed first edition of Judy Blooms in the unlikely event I've got a Judy Bloom for my collection. She has been my favorite, one of my favorite authors since I was a kid with fudge books and Are You There, God, It's Me, Margaret, and Wifey, and all of her other books. She also, this is one of her uh, grown up books, so um, I haven't read it yet. So now I have a new book and I have an autograph, so perfect gift, I think. And last up, this big frame in front of me. Um, I live in Orlando. We have a lot of local uh, community garage sale sites. And last weekend, I was on one that I'm also an administrator for. And I saw that a lady had some posters from Broadway in Orlando. Um, back in the early to mid 90s, Orlando used to have a lot of touring Broadway shows. And um, this lady had six posters. 
and I'm more than likely going to call her again in this coming week when I get paid to buy the rest. But I was so excited when I saw this. Um, I could not meet her fast enough to pick it up. Jerry Lewis it Damned Yankees. I recently saw a signing, a private signing with him. Uh, that was charging, I think, between $80 to $120. And I paid $10 for this on the garage sale website. Um, like I said, I will be calling her because she had some other really nice pieces. And she's charging the same price for them. So I will be adding some more to my collection in the next week. And I will be sure to video them to show you. So this is going to go on my wall. I can, I, I have actually had it hang, popped up on my stereo system since I picked it up last Saturday. So this is what I got in the last couple weeks since my last video. Hopefully there will be more stuff coming back because I miss making videos. I don't really have anything else going on. So, um, thank you guys for subscribing to the Graphing Geek Facebook page. And I am loving the questions I've been getting. And I answer every question I get. Um, lots of how-to questions I've been getting lately. And I will be answering more as they come in. Hopefully this summer I'll be able to do some how-to videos too since I will have more free time and someone to uh, tape for me as I to make videos for me as I go through you know putting the letters together and everything so thanks for watching and I will talk to you later bye